taking care of the pork ribs today. So he's going to be smoking it outside. And this looks good already, but of course it'll look better when it's cooked. Flowers and then we'll... Can we wrap it? Okay. Slide it stuff on it. And I'm going to make guacamole. So I'm waiting on the jalapenos and I'm going to mash all these up. Put some red onions in, squeeze some limes and some coriander, which is still in the fridge. I seriously can't begin how easy this is. I just like scoop out the avocados and squeeze some limes in as much as you want. But I start with two limes, small limes. Um, coriander. I deseeded the jalapeno and just used half of it, so just dice it all up nice and fine. Then you just want to smash, stir, and it's up to you how mushy you want it, or you just want chunky salsa, I mean, sorry, guacamole. Make sure you put in salt as well. I put in about one fourth of a teaspoon, and that's it. Mada, mada, makin gel salsa namkan kap guacamole. Mm. I'm glad I didn't add a lot of salt in the guacamole because the chips are pretty salty. So good. Yum, look at that. Look how my hook. But it's falling off the bone. I know, that's a thing. That's what you want. Yeah. Spatula. Look I don't think that. I need to put any more out with you. You're just a little dry, make it a little drier. Let it fire for a little while? Okay. Yep. Pit master, yes. This is after, what, five and a half hours? Well, uh, two hours and a half break and then take it out and put the barbecue sauce. So this is nice. Look how soft, falling off the bone. So we put the rub on. Bruce got it for Christmas. Mmm. Look at that. Mmm. -mm. Some assorted vegetables with ranch dip and the pork ribs corn and I'm ready to eat. Bon appetit. Madame, madame, I can count them.